What is going on guys? Gray here today and I'll talk about the new kind of uh, teaser trailer we got for the DLC that will be coming out of course later this year. We're going to get an official reveal of course kind of at the end of January. If you've not seen the video I will link it down in the description so you can check it out for yourself. I know a lot of people have their speculations of what all is going to be involved kind of with this new content. But one thing that I found kind of interesting was all of the, you know, whole idea of it was kind of being on the water, you know, the ships and things of that nature, which makes me think well, we have the ability to finally travel maybe on the waterways. I know a lot of people have asked for this for a really long time. A lot of people have want, wanted the ability to travel by ship, to travel by, you know, whether it be a small boat or uh, a raft of some sort to go fishing in. A lot of people have asked for that over the years. They wanted fishing to have an upgrade and they wanted the ability to be able to go out in the water a little bit deeper and fish maybe within some type, type of small you know like a personal raft like where you or maybe one friend could fit in something like that i'm kind of curious if they will go that far into it uh we might get something or we might get something i, I think with smaller uh, boats and smaller things that 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 would not be really out of the question in my opinion i think that could be something that is doable by zoss now, whether it comes to being able to travel across in massive ships, I'm not sure if they're actually going to go with that idea. That would be absolutely amazing if they did. I'm just not sure if they're going to, because I think it would take a lot of work to be able to add, you know, large ships and, you know, different ways of travel through the waterways in the game, considering, you know, everything else that goes on as well, you know, when it comes to coding and whatnot. But it would be absolutely amazing if we did have that option. I think of things like the last several Assassin's Creed games, you know, where you can travel back and forth between different zones and different areas on, on ships, and it was an absolute blast. People love that. But even if we have the option just to have, you know, some personal small uh, crafts to be able to do some small water crafts to be able to go fishing on, to be able to, you know, kind of just do other things on, that would be pretty interesting. I think people, a lot of people would enjoy that. But I'm really curious to see what you guys think. What do you guys think about this upcoming DLC? What do you think we'll see and kind of what kind of info we'll get in uh, kind of the end of January when all this is announced? What are you expecting from this year's content within the Elder Scrolls Online? Leave me a comment. Let me know for sure. And would you like to see larger ships and, and things of that nature kind of coming into the game where you can travel with big, large groups where you could travel with you know, all of your guild members and things like that. Would you like to see smaller uh, style watercrafts where you can go fishing and, you know, maybe do some other things uh, that I'm not really thinking of right now. Zoss might have some cool ideas for the ways that they could work boats and things into the game. Of course, leave me a comment with your thoughts. If you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. Also check out the merch store that is linked in the description as well. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.